Welcome to the Empathy Lens. Please shift your field of view to one of the title graphics. Parking was okay? It was fine. It wasn't bad at all. Okay. Oh my gosh. You look fantastic. I Thank love you. this and your hair looks so great. Thank you so much. Okay. So that's Dr. Brickley. He heads the Anthropological Research Lab and leads the Middle Eastern Archaeological Lab. Okay. Is he here? Of course he's here. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So you're applying for his vacant position. Believe it or not, He's been promoted to associate dean. Mm. Mm-hmm. Okay. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so anyway, <laughs> focus on your research. Okay. I have to go be a committee member. Okay. Research. Yeah. You're gonna be great. You. You're gonna nail it. John, welcome. Dr. Carlton Brickley. Dr. Brickley. That is stunning. Is that woven into your hair? Japanese? Yes, I... I toured Western Africa last summer. Not research, per se. I didn't realize you were from Gabon. I'm from Baltimore. I meant where you're really from. Where your family's from? Actually, I don't know. This was a birthday present from my brother. Well, your brother certainly has exotic taste. That's a... A beautiful accent in your hair, Sean. Mm -hmm. Am I sitting here? Uh, please, take your seats. We're still waiting for Dr. Daniels, but we can get started. Let's go around and introduce ourselves to Sean. I'll start. Welcome, Dr. Blaylock. Thank you. I'm Dr. Lisa Chambers. I identify as she, her, hers. Sociocultural Anthropology, Gender, Queer Studies. I've been in the department for seven years. Dr. Monica Dykstrom. This is my fifth year as a professor here. I teach Biological and Evolutionary Anthropology, and my research focuses on brain evolution and the origins of language. Welcome, Dr. Blaylock. Thank you. Hey, guys. So sorry. Traffic was a mess. <laughs> Did we flip our interviews? No, no changes. Uh, Sean, this is Dr. Sean. <laughs> Sean, <laughs> nice to meet you. Davis Daniels. Dr. Daniels. Nice to meet Sweet you, Sean. You. I got tied up dropping my daughter off at preschool. Oh. You got any kids? My, um, I We have a terrific program on campus, pre-K through six, if you're planning. <laughs> I'm sorry, is this part of the application process? I, I really don't think I need to discuss that. Oh, no, no, that's your business. You're right. Let's respect Sean's time here. It's one of our terrific benefits as faculty on campus. Thank you for sharing that with me, Dr. Daniels. Uh, please, let's get started. Uh, so I'm Dr. Frank Walford, chair of the uh, anthropology department, and this is an interview for the position of assistant professor of anthropology, a tenure track position. We have a number of questions we're asking all of our candidates. Thank you, Dr. Wolford. Thank you so much for this opportunity. I look forward to proving to you and the committee that I am a great fit for this position. <clears throat> and I'm excited for the opportunity to join this community. Well, please uh, tell us about your teaching experience. Were you teaching while you were a graduate student at Berkeley? I was teaching undergraduate studies in my first year in the PhD program, and as well as receiving the Chancellor's Opportunity Fellowship, I started teaching in my second year. You were teaching courses as a doctoral candidate? Um, graduate student instructor. I was teaching seminars on research and field practices. Yeah, I see. Graduate student instructor. <clears throat> it's a very competitive application process. I familiar with their program. Of course. No disrespect intended, Dr. Daniels. My mentor, my advisor, 
was Dr. Jennifer Conkley. Well, is she is my mentor. Oh. Yeah, we received her letter um, yesterday. Oh, a bit late. <laughs> I'll provide uh, copies for the committee. Yeah, it's not a surprise for a Jennifer old girl. <laughs> well, after receiving my doctorate, Dr. Contley assigned me to the GeoSwap lab. GeoSwap? Mm -hmm. Geoarchaeology and Southwest Asia Prehistory Laboratory. That lab has a fantastic reputation. Emilio Rodriguez. Uh, Emilio was one of my top students. Yeah, he's in our graduate program now. I love his curious brain and the way that he makes connections that other students can't see. And sometimes professors. <laughs> <laughs> Glimmering brilliance. Mm -hmm. So you designed GeoSwap? Co-designed. Jennifer Conkley and myself. Mm. Um, essentially it was for training graduate and undergraduate students in lithic technology. Uh, Co-designed it with Dr. Conkley. That's correct, Dr. Brinkley. As an adjunct, I also taught undergraduate courses as well. You left Berkeley after a year? You are lecturing at the University of Maryland in Towson. Yeah, my, um, I had to go back home. My family needed me. I understand. It's a huge decision to make. I'm sure they greatly appreciated your choice. Would you like to share more about your decision? Um, my dad, he was sick, but he's better now. <clears throat> um, can we move on to something else? It was my pleasure. Thank you so much for your time and this opportunity. I look forward to hearing from you soon. Thank you, Dr. Bolilak. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.